Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to bringing you the vision video. What if I guess today is something a bit different? Today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get yourself the Skull MC gloves. Very, very easy and very simple. If you guys didn't know, I made a video like this back on the Bullfrog about 2-3 days ago. A lot of people said it helped them out. A lot of people said um, they actually got the Bullfrog. So if you guys haven't seen that video and you are looking for a good Bullfrog to use for PvP or PvE, I would recommend watching that video. I will leave a link in the description below uh, because like I said, a lot of people said it helped them out and they found that video useful. Anyways, today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get yourself a pair of the Skull MC gloves. If you guys don't know the entire hype behind these gloves, they're pretty much the best things you can have um, if you're making a high-end slash exotic build. A ton of people would normally use the Savage gloves if they don't have a good pair of Skull MC gloves, but if you do have them, they are way, way better, and they're just, they just pretty much make a difference. So as I said, if you are looking for them, this video is for you. So I actually got in the past five or six days about six or seven different drops of the Skull MC gloves. Not all of them were very, very good. Some of them were just pretty much plain out trash and I had to discard them on the spot. But some of them were actually really good, like Assault Rifle Damage, SMG Damage, and I actually got a good Marksman Rifle pair. Um, so what I've been doing actually is a little bit different than what I did to the Bullfrog. For the Skull MC gloves, you guys want to focus on two main things to pretty much farm for and repeat with your friends or by yourself. Uh, so the first thing is the DZ Supply Drops. The DZ Supply Drops actually have a very, very good chance of getting uh, the Skull MC Gloves. Now, you won't actually get them from the crate, like when you open the crate. It's usually from the boss that you kill uh, besides the crate. There's usually like a boss that spawns with the crate. Um, whenever you kill that boss, you have a very good chance of getting a pair of Skull MC Gloves from there. That's actually where I got most of my really good ones from. And the other part that you want to focus on is farming the landmarks. Now the landmarks are pretty much just the purple areas on the map and they usually have a lot of bosses in them. Sometimes it's one, sometimes it's two, and sometimes they can be up to four. I'm pretty sure if you go in the higher DZs, uh, the more bosses will spawn at those landmarks. But whenever you clear them and whenever you kill those bosses, you usually have a good chance of getting it either from A, uh, the boss, or B when you actually clear the landmark. Now I'm pretty sure every time I did the landmarks, I actually got my Skull MC Gloves from the boss and not the actual reward. So I don't even think you have to complete the landmark itself, you can just kill the boss and move on to the next one. And then come back and the boss will respawn after I think it's like 10-15 minutes, uh, the boss will respawn again. So like I said, the DZ supply drops kill the boss around there and the landmarks and the higher DZs. You want to be in the higher DZs, I found the best luck to work in the, like, the DZ5, DZ6, DZ7 landmarks. Not really anything lower than that, I actually farmed a lot of the landmarks in the lower DZs and I had no luck for like 2 days and then when I moved up, when I went to the like DZ8, DZ7, that's where most of my exotics were dropping. So uh, that pretty much concludes the video. Let me know in the comment section below if this video helps you guys out and if you get a pair of these gloves for your build. If you do, just drop a comment down below, I'm actually really curious to see um, how many of you guys this will help out and how many of you guys will actually get these gloves. But like I said, that pretty much concludes the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one.